Right now, Denver school teachers are preparing to possibly strike for the first time in 24 years. Salary negotiations with Denver Public Schools ended late last night with no agreement. Nicole Brady is live outside DPS. And Nicole, what's holding things up? Oh, well, Molly, at some point during the 15 hour long negotiating session here yesterday, the Denver uh, uh, t classroom Teachers Association realized they weren't going to get their salary demands. So instead, they offered up a contract extension to give them more time to negotiate. But the union says the DPS superintendent flat out told them teachers aren't getting another dime. Things are heating up and picket lines are a real possibility. 1994, back when people still wore these hats, that's the last time there was a teacher strike in Denver. <laughs> Now it could happen again if the district doesn't agree to an extension with more time to talk about pay raises. We offered a modest extension to the district uh, through January um, to give us time to tackle some of the school funding issues um, and also let our teachers know that the system would be safe, that they wouldn't have to worry about an expiration while we did that. Um, the district balked at that. <laughs> After holding walk-ins earlier this week, teachers came into negotiations Wednesday hoping for a starting base salary of 45000 a year and a pay scale based on their experience and education. Currently, Denver teachers are paid for performance. The district wants to keep that incentive-based system. DPS released a statement saying they offered three possible contract extensions, 45 days, 90 days, or three years. But the union walked away saying they would only agree to a 10-month extension. The union feels 90 days isn't enough time and three years is too long to wait for changes. Both sides will go back to the bargaining table, but teachers may end up doing something they haven't done in 24 years. <laughs> Strike. Teachers are obviously at work today. They'll be at work tomorrow. We're going to continue the conversation with teachers and really let them decide what they want to do in response. At this hour, talks haven't resumed yet. We don't know when exactly they will. Now, the DPS superintendent in his statement indicated he's optimistic they will be able to reach some kind of agreement on a contract extension soon. We'll be watching for that and bring you any developments. We're live this morning. Nicole Brady, Denver 7.